Just make sure I fit. <laughs> I'm a bit taller than you. I feel like I don't I'm fit. slouching, that's why. I gotta move it. <laughs> oh. Ah! Ah! The old YouTube is back. <laughs> I'm yeah. back in the game. I know you are. I've missed miss filming with you, actually. Yeah, I can imagine. And um, just to address my attire, I've had a really, really busy day. Yeah, speaking of a dress, you could have at least got dressed. <laughs> <laughs> starts, I just want to let all of you know that this video is sponsored by Omni, which is a great app where you can connect with local people in your area who have the same interests as you. Here you can see my profile, you know, I've got some nice pictures of myself, I've done a little bio, I put my interests on there. It is also ad-free, so you can swipe without being interrupted. It's a really good app. Go in my bio down below so you can download it and try it out for yourself. But definitely check it out. It's a really great app. I've been speaking to quite a few people on there. It's a very secure environment. They use like advanced algorithms so you know you're not going to match with any catfishes. Everyone's a real person which is always nice to know. So get on there. Get swiping because you never know. You might match me and we might start talking and, and you could be the one. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm the one for you. Maybe you're the one for me. Who knows? But check out Omi right now. An amazing app. Link is down below, click on it, download it, and uh, yeah, get to swiping and find love. Or maybe a best friend. Or me. Do you know what we're doing today? There's nothing about dating. We are, we are. So I went online and I asked you lovely people to just kind of tell me your worst dates, really. And me and me and Toffee are going to react. Maybe, maybe we can offer some advice. Should I be offended that you chose me for this? Like, because I've got such a checkered dating history. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, mm, who should I choose? I don't know, I just thought you'd be great at it. So yeah, I'm, the, I don't, I'm not really a dater. No, you're not really. Why am I? I'm just straight in for the kill. <laughs> I've got some of your worst dates on my phone. Are you are you ready for some of these uh some of these dates? They're pretty weird. Yeah, but there's nothing better than hearing dating stories. That's why yeah. I always say to my friends, like, if a guy asks you out on a date, fine, it might be an absolute disaster. Yeah. But at least you'll have a brilliant story to tell. Had one date with a guy, it was so awkward we barely talked, and I faked a text from my housemate after an hour to escape. But when I got home, I had a text from him saying, I've considered it, and yes, I will take you on. I quickly blocked his number. Oh no! Now, I have experienced this in real life, not having, well, have you? <laughs> not having anyone done it to me that I know of, but I have faked phone calls oh, from God. my manager to get me out of awkward situations, I and I know Connor's done you. the same, well, like one of my best friends saying, I need you to call me quickly and pretend I've got to be somewhere. I just, oh, I don't know whether my standards of dates are like so low, I'm so grateful that I'm there. <laughs> I just don't know whether I would cut the date up short, so even if it's really shit. You've done that to me. I bet you have. Wait, hello? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I, I fully agree with that. Because sometimes it's just awkward telling them that you want to leave. We were out on a first date. We were talking lots about our mutual friends, neighbours, <laughs> and families, etc. And lots of the names were familiar. Long story short, I discovered that she was my second cousin. Oh, no! God, I wouldn't know what real? to do. That's really shocking. Yeah. What if you fell in love with them, like love at first sight? Ah! Well, no, it would instantly go out the window when they said that they're your cousin. I quite enjoy this. Come on, give me more, give me more. He started talking about what I thought of potential baby names. Love it. One of the names was Shepherd. <laughs> its nickname would be Sheppy. Oh, it would be Pie. <laughs> Listen, he always oh got God. pied when he grew up, there'd be a reason. Yeah, come here, Sheppy. Oh, Sheppy Pie. I would absolutely I love it. Them. And also, the fact that someone might even want to make babies with me is a real turn up for the books, and I think mm. it should be embraced. More like a Should dog. You? What, Sheppy? Yeah. Here, Sheppy. I'll do that to my kids as well, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Oi! <laughs> First date with a guy who pretended we were being filmed for a reality TV show. Very me. <laughs> Very you and Mikey. Yeah. Anytime anything went wrong, for example, he knocked over his glass of red wine on the table, he would just he would gesture to the corner of the bar and say, Simon, make sure you edit that bit out. <laughs> As you can imagine, there was no second date. I'd love that. I love it so much. That's something I think I would, if I was a bit pissed on a date, I would end up doing. I've probably done it a billion times with Made in Chelsea. Yeah, you would. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'd be yeah. like, oh, what? There's cameras staring at me? Oh no, what a shame. I'd embrace them. <laughs> yeah, of course. I'd be acting up for them. Yeah, but then some people who aren't like us, Jack, who like, don't love the attention. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I think he sounds like an absolute oh, cat. Classic. Yeah. Date number two, and we were hit by a car, like crossing the streets as pedestrians and a car smacked right into us and drove off. The guy is now my boyfriend, so in a weird way, hashtag grateful. Oh my god, that is fucking hilarious. But I also never want to experience that again. Okay, this, you're going to think this is made up, but when my mum met my dad, mm. they were on a date and they were walking like up the high street. I know exactly where they were. And there was my mum's ex-boyfriend.
boyfriend and he came running across the road to beat up my dad because dad had stolen mum and the car hit him, the taxi hit him, he was absolutely fine. <laughs> but my dad's like, it was like something out of a film. Oh, you know it's meant to be when something Yeah, happens. yeah, exactly, very funny. We worked out there. Yeah, my hair didn't call you Sheppy. <laughs> Chef so, so Toffolo. <laughs> yeah, fair play. He's already good. I'm gonna set that up. Connor, go, 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 over across the road. <laughs> it was a first date with a friend of a friend. I was told he was a cat lover and that I would love him. I'm a cat lover. Hey, you are. Oh, sorry, it says a fellow cat lover, so obviously oh. he was a cat lover as well. And I was told that I would love him. So he picks me up for dinner and his cats are in the back of the car. <laughs> <laughs> a little strange, but I went along with it. This cat gets violently sick, covering the entire cat and myself in vomit. We didn't make it to the restaurant. Oh no! Oh. I feel like that's like being hit by the car though. It's such a bonding experience, you know. What better way to get to know someone than their cat? Why was Either the cat in the back of the car? Two of them were. And apparently <laughs> maybe he lived in his car. Was it like a camper van type thing? Perhaps. Cats in the back. But the thing is, the cats were in the back of the car, so why? how did the cat sick? Did the cat projectile vomit? I've never seen a cat being sick. Have know. you not? I have. Do you no. want to see some videos? No, what? That's a bad date. I forgot. That's that. a bad oh, yeah, date. The cat sick one. That's a really bad date. Anyway, guys, there we have it. Hopefully you enjoyed this week's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Check out Toff's channel. Woohoo! Fancy stop loading a video. I have loaded two be in videos it. in the past three weeks. Thank you very much. Ooh. Maybe. Maybe last month. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe last four weeks. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you very soon. Bye. Bye.